I'm back in New York. I was here pretty much exactly a year ago, which was about three or four months before None of This Is True was published. I didn't know what to expect. I knew that it was a quite out there book. I felt quite nervous about it. It was very different to the book that had come out before, The, uh, the Night She Disappeared. Since then, it's been published all over the world. I don't think I've ever had such a white hot response to anything I've ever published before because the book is essentially about the slipperiness of truth. So of course it's sort of invited lots of theories in general. I've got to the point on my Instagram where I have a pre-written piece so that I can paste it into replies to all the many, many readers who've written to me saying, help! I need to know what really happened and what was the truth. I've been hearing from readers, such a good book club book because there's so much to talk about. One thing that's been uh, incredible is the double denim book parties. <laughs> and so I've had quite a lot of photographs sent to me of book groups who've met up and they've come in Josie attire. I would never have imagined in a million years when I was sitting behind my laptop thinking, oh, maybe Josie should be a bit weird and wear denim all the time that it would sort of spawn these like uh, book clubs all over the world of people turning up in their in their double denim outfits i don't think i've ever had so much fun publishing a book publicizing a book talking about a book meeting readers and answering questions about a book so yeah this has been an absolute gift